Hello and welcome to Signature Flight Support in Long Beach. I'm here to check out a very historic and vintage plane. It first flew in 1942 and was significant in the Pacific Theater in World War II. Meet Doc, a B-29 Superfortress. This is a special plane as this is one of only two B-29s that are airworthy and flying anywhere in the world. This plane is in Long Beach for the next two days to offer rides to the public. So during my lunch break, I had a chance to go out to Signature and have a quick peek. This plane was built in 1944 and delivered to the U.S. Army in 1945. It was one of 1,620 planes built by Boeing in Wichita, Kansas. And the plane is registered November 69972. This plane had a lot of state-of-the-art technology for its day, including a pressurized cabin and an analog-controlled firing system, which allowed two people to operate four remote machine gun turrets. A few other facts about this plane include the engines being Wright R3350 duplex cyclone radial engines. One of the things you'll notice on the takeoffs is that it's very slow to lift. This plane could fly up to 31,850 feet and its cruise speed at around 220 miles per hour. Its range was about 3,200 miles. For comparison, a Boeing 737 MAX 8 has a cruise speed of about 600 miles an hour and a range of around 3,800 miles. Though it was built to be a heavy and strategic bomber, this plane did not see any military combat. And by 1951, the plane had been converted to a radar calibration aircraft. The plane was retired and sat in the Mojave Desert outside Los Angeles until it was discovered in 1987 by a man named Tony Mazzolini. After it was found, a lot of hard work was done to restore the plane. It even had a lot of restoration work at its home facility in Wichita, Kansas. A really cool homecoming for a really special plane. In 2013, Doc's friends, a 501c3 nonprofit, took over the restoration of the plane. And today, the plane travels around the country for air shows and flights for the public. So here it is in Long Beach and there will be two flights a day on 19 and 20 September. Today's flight will take off on runway 30 towards the northwest, make a turn south, then travel along the coast down towards South Orange County before turning back towards Long Beach. This will be about a 30 minute flight.
There are a lot of people out here on 20 September, as there would have been a 5 p.m. and 6 p.m. departure. And I would have loved to have actually been on board. However, the least expensive seat was $618. And unfortunately, the 6 p.m. departure ended up being canceled because there were some engine problems. So enjoy this last takeoff. Thanks for joining me for this B-29 Super Fortress plane spotting special in Long Beach. Remember to leave a comment and a like, and subscribe to see more. Thanks again!